There's no other word for it, and it will be your undoing. You must understand, Gregory, the board has been patient with you, but their generosity has limits. As does their imagination. Can you not fathom the secrets we are on the verge of unlocking? By accepting your hysterical and outlandish case studies as fact? You presume too much, Gregory. I believe we're done here. <sighs> Try to see the larger implications, Gregory. I am, sir. The question is, are you? You're a talented doctor, Gregory. It would be a tragedy if you lost your license to practice. Miss Magnus. I'm sorry you had to hear that. I don't understand. Why are they always so angry at you? They're not angry, sweetheart. They're afraid. Of what? Oh, of, of being wrong, mainly. Just put it out of your mind. How can you say that? They mean to end your career. Helen, let it go. Please, father. What have you done to make them so afraid of you? Tell me. Undetected, that does require a modicum of silence. A modicum, right. Why are we hiding? We're on an island in the middle of nowhere. It's a crypt, not a pentagon. A crypt potentially containing an elixir capable of prolonging life for centuries. Such secrets are rarely left unguarded. Yeah, but why can't we just look? of the dead, best to be avoided if at all possible. Right. Okay. I got, I'm going in and go around, but what was that wiggly one you did? I'm cutting off your allowance. Let's go.
be my first crypt, but aren't they supposed to hold dead people? Yes, yes, I realize he's left me five messages. That's why I'm returning his call. Okay, okay. When do you expect him back in the office? No, 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 don't, don't page him. I'll, uh, I'll call him back then. Okay, thank you. Hey. Hi. So that was a submission, huh? Rules, crypt, standard fare. Uh, new guy, still not sleeping. No such thing as standard fare. Great. So I was just wondering, um, how you doing since... Since I learned my dad was a time-traveling nut job? <laughs> I was gonna say troubled soul, but... Uh... Peachy, thanks for asking. Hey, uh, you know, that's some pretty serious information to be carrying around. If you ever want to just sit down and talk and kind of let it out. I'm here. Here's some advice about me. I'm not big on sharing. So just stick to helping the freaks. That's why you're here. Ciao. See ya. Three not-so-dead women found in coffins. There's another day at the office. All three are comatose. Fortunately, brain functions and vital organs seem to be intact. So they're normal? Near as I can tell. The scans aren't detecting any physical anomalies, but they can only tell us so much. I'm administering a time-release stimulant. It should bring them back to consciousness slowly with as little physical trauma as possible. What about emotional trauma? More your department, I should think. Until they awaken, we have to rely on more traditional forensic methods. Now, this fellow. Fond memories. These creatures detected our presence early and possessed unnatural speed and strength. Definitely not normal. Well, not as you would define it, no. I was about to gather some fluid samples. Care to assist? Uh, I'd love to, but um, I better get back to my office and get the whole head shrinking operation up and running. If you wish.
You okay, Ash? You need a mint. Henry! I know, I know, I know, I know. It didn't work. Which is why we have dry runs. I could have died. Well, from him? Come on, he's a puppy dog. May I? Full charge. Minimum level. There you go. The calibration issue. These long-range acoustic devices get a bit wonky when you jostle them, so. Henry, I do a lot of jostling when I work. But choose a different weapon. I got a new case of Tech 9s in the truck. They still got that new gun smell and everything. That was minimum. I want my usual gear ready for Friday, including the LRADs, calibrated to handle jostling. OK, well, the regular stuff's no problem, but the Sonics, you're dreaming. Well, besides, these are only good if you're going after the... No, 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 no. Wait a minute, wait a minute. You are not thinking of trying to kill what I think you're thinking of trying to kill. Just make it happen, Henry. Ash, that is a completely unsanctioned... Friday. I'm gonna tell your mother! Suck up. Sir, I just, you know, I think I need some time to um, travel and, and, and meet some new people and, you know, see things that I haven't seen before. Uh, y yes, sir, yes. Um, so if you could just process. Thank you. Thank you. And so much for the letter of recommendation. You're needed in the infirmary. Okay, new rule. Don't do that. anything I'm saying? Hey, it, it's okay. It's okay. You, you, you're okay. You're in a safe place. Okay. Okay. All right, you're okay. You're in, you're in a safe place. Just relax. So you can talk. My sis sisters, Tatha and Karen, are they? They're fine. Your sisters are fine. You just woke up first. You're in a medical facility. We brought you here after we found you in a dark place. Do you have any idea how you ended up there? Creatures. They came to our village. They weren't human. Yeah, sounds familiar. Uh, they took us with them, and then I woke up here. Your village, is there anyone there, your friends or family that we could contact and let them know you're all right? I'm sorry, I just, I can't remember. Well, it's okay. Just take your time.
place. It's like nothing I've ever ever seen before. There's there's light, but I see no candles. There's warmth, but there's no fire, no no sunlight. Danny, before you and your sisters were taken, how much do you remember? I'm not certain. Last mass, we were mourning the loss of our priest to the miasmas. The miasmas? It's a sickness that has cursed many villages surrounding us in recent months. And there is no cure. So you remember the miasmas? Anything else? <laughs> Why can't I remember? Just give it time. <laughs> I understand you've quite the weekend planned. Thank you, Henry. He called out of concern for your well-being, something you seem determined to sacrifice. You mean I'm gonna get myself killed? God, why can't you talk like a normal person? Ashley, I realize there are things that need to be discussed between us. Sure, Mom. Let's, uh, let's play treats and bond and do each other's hair. Right after we'll kill a bunch of ghouls for sport. Those creatures are on the contraband list for a reason. There are specific rules governing their capture. Well, a lot of things changed since good old dad showed up. It changes nothing. I had no reason well, he to- he me prisoner? <sighs> Mom, I froze on that island. Okay, I hesitated. Do you realize how major a problem that is? For both of us. And you think that by going off on some insane hunt, you'll suddenly overcome your fears? Well, Ashley, I can't do that. I'm not worth a damn to anybody, am I? Please don't do this. These creatures exhibit a terrifying propensity for violence. Any future encounters with them must be undertaken with extreme caution. Physiology appears human in base form, though significant anomalies to the face and torso indicate the possibility of mutation at a base genetic level. Oh, uh, okay. You need to, uh, you need to put a sock on the door or something before you do that. He's breathtaking, isn't he? Yeah, that's one way of putting it. How are our guests doing? Confused. At least the one who's awake is. She mentioned a disease that was killing people in her village called the miasmas, which translates from the Greek meaning poisoned air. Plague, actually. The bubonic plague, specifically. However, the last reported serious outbreak was in Scotland in 880. Meaning? She's crazy. Is that your professional opinion? Look, I know there's a lot of things that are outside the realm of our knowledge, blah, blah, blah. But logically, if she were from 800 AD, she wouldn't speak English the way we do. I'm guessing that linguistics and grammar have evolved somewhat since then. Some would say devolved. Whatever the point is, is that we wouldn't understand her. Which makes her a very sweet, very delusional woman. Possibly. If you have a theory, please share it with the class. The liquid we found the three of them in bears similar chemical properties to suspended animation formulae used by southern voodoo cults. <laughs> the human body cannot survive intact for 1,200 years. I don't care what kind of magic bath products you use. And I agree. So, these women are either far more than they appear or, to use your incredibly clever vernacular... Crazy. The question we should be asking is why the Keepers were so anxious to stop us from getting into that crypt. What is it about these women that they don't want us to know? <laughs> <laughs>